sausage. <laughs> Why would you come back to the village? <laughs> <laughs> that uh recreators guys um episode one hey it is what it is man um wow wow this was this was interesting and honestly i was through a valid mind fuckage process i mean just as well as pretty much majority well the other two characters main characters seem to be in the show um just trying to piece things together with this one right now uh we got this young guy pretty much and he seems like he's an aspiring kind of you know mangaka you know what i'm saying um and uh his i guess you know one of his shows that he enjoys uh watching is uh is the show that she's from you know and it's it's crazy like he has the original source he has the uh the manga and as well as you know he's watching the uh the the fucking anime and shit and I believe um this called what is a von gel chevy or some shit i don't know it's just fucking crazy man it was, it was definitely a lot of different little things to, to take in and shit and what the fuck what 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 the fuck the main reason why i wanted to check this out is because i heard that uh the creator of black lagoon i believe uh was behind this and shit and you know that instantly sparked my interest because i love me some goddamn black lagoon okay i i definitely do and the the quality in this is dope i i i do enjoy the quality but right now i'm just kind of fucking flabbergasted he has this uh this this fucking uh tablet or something and you know he's i guess he's trying to check out the, the latest episode and he's like oh the latest episode's not out yet but um I guess he was starting to watch the trailer for the next episode or something like that. And then all of a sudden, he, it it transports him uh, to this different realm, this different, you know, world and shit. And he's in between uh, this character right here, uh, Celestia, uh, fighting the in this fucking mech or some shit against this fucking this 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 wizard chick or something this fucking witch chick this lady and she seems like a beast you know she's got all those daggers circling around her and everything she's acting like nothing's a fucking problem uh but quickly kind of seems to dismantle uh celestia here and uh he, he's there as well and she ends up saving him and and in turn He's, you know, he's still holding on to the tablet and it transports them back uh, to, to his world, you know, uh, basically our world. And, you know, and the other the other lady, the witch, she comes back as well. And I believe her name was, uh, I forgot her fucking name, but uh, she, she calls this, this, uh, his world pretty much um, the, the land of the gods or something like that. And she says something along the, along the lines like, they're gonna bring punishment to this uh, world of the gods or something. I'm not sure exactly what's going on there, but you know, as we watch, I guess we're gonna go ahead and find out. And then this one other character comes up. Seems like she's, um, you know, kind of quiet, but uh, she seems to be very supportive of her of uh, Celestia and everything. And she, uh, the, the the wish chick or whatever, she uh seems like i don't care calling her a witch fucking shit but hey it is what it is but she is obviously um calling celestia this uh this 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 pretty much this princess or whatever this you know so she obviously has some type of uh noble uh lineage and shit but this this other girl that comes i believe she uh called her a uh Meteora or something like that or Matora or something I don't know this, this shit is it, it definitely just had me like okay what the fuck is going on here this this episode was definitely there to um make a statement of intrigue 
you know, because you, you have questions, you know, and I didn't look up into any synopsis or nothing like that. You know, I'm just kind of going into it blind, but I usually do with, um, with, with series majority of the time. But I'm checking out this one on my own uh, invocation and shit. But uh, the action scenes were definitely on point, man. Uh, and, and, and enjoyed it, definitely enjoyed it. But um, you know, th they went ahead and he's he's living at home, you know, with his mom and stuff. And obviously, he's keeping everything on the hush and shit. I want to know exactly what's behind this whole, you know, kind of. Uh, transporting between the worlds and how exactly that really happened and you know and, and the thing is as i said in the, re in the reaction she came to terms with exactly um what was going on pretty quick um which tells me that you know she kind of knows about what's you know the possibilities of what's going on herself from where she's from most likely but um obviously she you know kind of wants to go back and shit and he's just like yo you know i'm not you know i'm not her this this fucking crazy ass bitch's ally or nothing like that i'm this is who i am this is what i'm about this is what i know like this is you know what, what i see you from and shit so um yeah it's it's a interesting kind of you know a little dynamic there but um interested to see how it's gonna go ahead and uh and, and play out but after they get done uh kind of holding her off and stuff they end up coming back to um his place because they pretty much have nowhere else to go you know uh celestia and this uh um Metora chick or whatever. I don't know. I gotta get her name right. My bad. I know I'm fucking, fucking crucifying that shit. But um, yeah, where it goes on from here, I'm really not too sure. Really not too sure. But we'll see, guys. But all right, y'all. Leave your comments below. Feel free to clear up some things and everything. Uh, for those of you that most likely probably know more about, you know, the setup and everything of the series, did I write that in the comment section? Make sure you leave your comments and your rates, guys. It shows me whether I should continue to you know check out the uh episodes and all that in the series as it goes on but all right guys follow me on twitch twitter and facebook see so you know my videos go live i'll check you out soon thanks for watching as always peace out what's poppin' my dudes make sure that you become a part of the central network subscribe to anime central one and anime central two Become a part of the gaming Twitch live streams on Play Central and also become a part of React Central. And if you want me to react to a video on React Central that you like, make sure you fill out the React Central request form. You can find a link to that in the description, as well as a link to all the entire Central network from Play Central to Anime Central 1 and 2, as well as my Patreon. Alright guys, I'll see you guys later.